now let's check it this is main candle this is, uh, strand candle next we are not recognized because this candle failed to break previous higher point have you seen next candle this candle we can say this is called master candle or that means this candle have two character okay this is bank nifty i'll say uh, i'll tell you one by one how to enter in this market exactly so now you can see next candle this candle fail to break this previous higher point that means this candle have last strand need both character there should be confirm the trend and strength this candle are confirming bullish trend and strength they break this previous higher point that means they have a more strength but this candle don't have strength this candle also indicating the trend bullish trend all right up trend both are but this candle don't have strength so that is calculating or no not counting this candle all right so next you can see this candle break previous higher point so this is a strand and bullish candle same these two candle fail to break this is called uh, like low momentum candle all right and the next we have seen this is a higher point now we have seen two small candle or you can say inside bar after that they are forming a bearish candle when bearish candle are forming we must wait to break this last momentum and oh, sorry strand and bullish candle which, which one last uh, bullish candle last one nearest last this candle have you seen this candle last candle now next they are forming here two inside bar after that they are this candle and they are forming candle in this area and those candle so we'll start selling breaking this lower point have you seen they must break this lower point we will start selling now we are ready to buy when will you start buying when they will break this previous higher point so this candle broke the previous higher point and this is our buy opportunity and remember if 20 moving average above one moving average so we will start only buy we never take any sell position blue and yellow line both are exponential moving average let me show you this is 20 moving average exponential and this is 50 moving average exponential when 20 moving average run above 50 moving average so we will looking for bar into hackenesi candlestick pattern right so first the buy opportunity we have seen here somewhere they broke this area all right this is our buy opportunity now most of the people are looking for sell in this candle have you seen so we are not looking for sell we are looking for buy only right now where is our buy entry in that case let me draw some line right so you will be able to understand we have seen this is the last candle have you seen which one last bullish momentum candle this one have you seen this one right they break previous higher point and higher point we are looking for a candle bearish candle who broke this lower point where is the lower point this is the lower point and this candle broke and this candle broke lower point when they are 
broke this lower point, now we are ready to buy. We are not looking for sell anymore because 20 moving average still running 50 moving average, 50 moving average. So we are looking for buy. Where is our buy opportunity? Now, opportunity, let me tell you. Remember this point. So this candle, this red candle broke this previous lower point. Have you seen? Now we gonna remove from this area and we are looking for buy or we are looking for a bullish momentum candle, right? Now, can you, can you count this candle, this small candle? No, we can't count because they are failed to break this higher point, there is higher point. Now we have seen this candle, this candle broke the lower point in this area. So right now we are looking for buy. Where is our buy opportunity? Our buy opportunity are at to 10 point above that candle. That means this bullish candle, right? We are looking for buy above this area. So let me show you. So in that case, I'm gonna draw a line then it comes to know properly. Now here you can see we have seen this candle and we are looking for at least four to five points from this area. Now you can see once they break, have you seen? Once they break this line, price continue toward upside. So we are not ready, we are not uh, uh, looking for sell because 20 is running above 50. We are looking for all right, so we place our buy order somewhere above and trigger buy and continue toward upside. Is it clear our buy entry? Is it clear, right? And see, price is running. We have seen downtrend in this area, downtrend, right? Most of the candle are forming a strong bearish candle in this area. Have you seen? in this area. No, we are not looking for sell. Most of the people are entering short in this area. That is the big mistake. By using Hekanesi candlestick pattern, people are start selling in this area. Once they place sell order, look, price boom. Why did it happen? How we filter? We filter used by 20 and 50 exponential moving average because 20 are still running above one, uh, sorry, 50 moving average. We are looking for buy. Now, where is our buy opportunity here? Right, let me tell you. Last, we have seen this candle. Uh, you can say bearish momentum candle, this candle, right? This candle. And they drop down and create a new low. Have you seen? And exactly here, we have seen lower point. I need to change the color, I think. Color is not drawing properly. Let me change the color. Yeah, it will be good, I think. Yeah, yes. Now I can see, this is the lower point. Exactly, I drawn a horizontal line by connecting this lower point, right? Exactly, I. Now we are, look we are looking for a bullish candle. Is it bullish candle? Am I looking for this candle? You just tell me, am I looking this candle, this candle long? No, 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 we are not this candle. Because this candle have both side weak. Both side weak, we are not looking for this candle. Yeah, we are not looking for this candle. Next candle. Here weak, here also weak. Both sides said, oh, we are not looking for this candle. Next, same candle here, we have seen weak point. Here weak point, or oh, you can say said, oh, we are not looking for this candle. Now we are looking for this candle who have one side. There is no lower said, oh. And exactly right now, I will uh, draw a horizontal line. Let me take this horizontal, uh, sorry, let me take this horizontal line and let me connect here somewhere, higher point. All right, have you seen? We have seen 
this candle now and i place a horizontal line here and i'm looking for buy here at least five to ten point when i place buy here this candle triggered my buy order and now later you can see price on continue toward the is it clear that is the secret of hackenesy and 60 to 70 percent they are giving uh correct uh result proper result right uh, like win rate you can say win rate all right so now you can see here let me show you now you can see same running here 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 now here is the big question most of the people are confusing here in this area let me now so here we have seen this is last candle let me show you last candle where is the last candle sorry uh, let me show you this is the last candle have you seen yeah definitely you can use five minute candle now this is the last candle this is the last point and last candle, last bearish candle. We are not counting this candle because they have failed to break this lower point. So later, which candle we have seen, bullish candle, who is bullish candle? Somewhere here we have seen bullish candle, they broke this line. And once we place our buy order five to 10 point, they fail to hit or oh, they fail to trigger our buy order and price drop down. Have you seen it? They fail to trigger our buy order. Is it clear? And price drop down. When price drop, we are ready to sell. Now let me let me show you. After we have seen price drop from this area. And then now moving average cross each other, 20 moving average running below, uh, what call? 20 moving average running below, 50 moving average, now we are ready to sell. Now, have you seen any bullish candle here in this area? All white candle we have seen. Have you seen any bullish candle? We have seen bullish candle, but <clears throat> no bullish momentum or bullish strand candle are seen in this area. So still we are not getting any sell opportunity. Is it clear? There is no sell opportunity. Instead of price falling down, we never see candle, bullish candle in this area. Right? So we never gonna take sell now later we have seen here we have seen they broke this line by forming a long strand bullish candle price are continue right first same same thing we first miss that opportunity we are looking for same bearish candle who broke the previous lower point have you seen now we are looking for same continue again they are forming and after that we have seen this is a last bearish candle right so when they are forming like that let me let me show you one by one then first we have seen this candle have you seen this candle where i pointing my mouse so we are looking for a bearish candle now next all candle inside in this candle all right so later we have seen this candle this candle broke the previous lower point and create new low still to buy now so now we are looking for a bullish candle so when we have seen a bullish candle appear in this area we place buy order somewhere here or in this candle somewhere here and when triggered our buy price continue toward upside all right in a 15 minute chart most of the people are trading in a 15 minute 
but most uh, important time time oh sorry five minutes uh, 15 minutes is most important time time all right okay let me show you yesterday how it should look like that so let's see in a yesterday who people comes to know i think yesterday was six right where is the six 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 let me draw a line here this is six and this is six 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 five 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 now from this area let's see have you seen that was six uh, the, uh that was five december all right this portion all right from this area this portion five i drawn this line vertical line and this is six december right six december i think uh, uh yeah yesterday okay i'll tell you stop loss exactly where to place all right so one by one first first you just clear entry and exit point right entry point first let me clear your entry point so i'll tell you exit point or stop loss so who people knows how to trade by using hackenesi let's see yesterday what happened all right clear now this is 50 exponential moving average and the 20 moving average are running below so what we are looking for now in which direction we ready to go we are ready to go in a downside we are ready to go only sell direction we will take only sell position we are not looking for buy now let me show you bullish candle we have seen last here this area let me draw a connecting this point all right so this was higher point all right so next candle they broke here in this candle all right first here was higher point and this candle form another new high and and in that case we are looking for a bearish candle who break uh, who broke the lower point where is the lower point now so now you can see this is the lower point <clears throat> have you seen this is the lower point in this candle right this is the higher point and this is the lower point and which one beer is candle we are not counting this candle because he have both side he has both side weak or shadow so we are not counting this candle right fail next candle this candle have only one side with this one that is called bearish uh, strength uh, momentum candle so we are looking for short for the sell so in that case i'll use sorry i'll use lower point where is the lower point have you seen the point now when we sell order this candle triggered our sl where our where our sl now i'll show you now tell me this candle is last candle have you seen this candle bullish last candle right bullish last candle this one and we'll place our sl a little more above in this area right and SL will be here. Is it clear your SL? Where is your SL? Kulbansin. Stop loss. This is our stop loss. Stop loss. Is it clear entry and exit point now? All right. So once who people follow, so let me show you continuously price is failing right continuously price is failing now you can see we have seen last bullish candle in this area this candle so let me draw directly here 
higher point. Let me draw higher point. This candle, last bullish candle. And we are looking for a bearish breakout candle. This candle broke and sell opportunity are there. Right here we have seen sell and the are already occurred and SL will be here, SL are, are there and target you can set your according to your money management if you say this is one R and set your target at least two R, all right? Tell again, NT point, NT point, NT point. Okay, don't be confused. If you have any doubt clearly, let me know. All right, so now you can see uh, this is current price. Let me zoom a little more. And here we have seen, yeah, right, it is perfect. All right. <clears throat> Now last we have seen this is bullish momentum candle or trend is bullish, but we are not looking for buy because 20 moving average is running below 50 moving average. So we are not looking for sell. Oh, sorry, buy. We are looking for sell. Now where we will enter sell? That is the important. Now we are looking for last bullish candle. We are not looking for weak candle dozy pattern type. We are looking for pure bullish momentum candle. Which one? Pure bullish momentum candle. Last one, right? This candle. All right. So now we have seen higher point are there. So above there, we will place SL, right? Now we are looking for breakout point. Where is the breakout point means? So lower point, where is the lower point? Here is the lower point. Have you seen? Is it clear? This is the lower point now. We are looking for a bearish momentum candle, not like dozy pattern or whatever. Purely bearish momentum candle, right? Now where we have seen this bearish momentum candle, this candle, this bearish momentum candle broke the lower point. We are not counting this candle. This candle also broke that lower point, but this candle is weak candle or dozy candle. Both sides they have shadow. That is why we are not counting. We are counting this candle who have only one side weak. We have seen this. This is the lower point. Now let's see. We are looking for sell and D. Now let me let me push the line here now i drawn here exactly now i'm going to take sell position below this candle below this candle so now we can see this candle place our sell order now this is our sell opportunity after breaking this lower point we are looking for sell and this area this point called one r or to our or whatever you are taking that means sl stop loss and target place at least two r somewhere here like that is it clear mr uh, just a minute subha sarmila subha sarmila okay I'm uh, whatever I'm trying to like explain very simply for for understand properly because technical if you miss like uh, one like uh, misguide somebody are you you're gonna lost your money right so always be clear and we need specific rule for NT and exit specific rule. Uh, is the BN what is the meaning of BNM or oh, bank nifty yeah yeah definitely no 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 not only bank nifty you can go let me show you let me drop any stocks from directly from so let me show you this is the HDFC automatically they come I don't know so now now we can see let me tell you you can use anywhere now from this <coughs> from this area you see, uh, this is HDFC and five minute. All right, so let me tell you. 
we have seen perfect bullish candle here this is the lower point and broke by this lower this bearish candle and here we have placed sell and triggered our sell in this area sl are somewhere here and you can see continuously prices down falling down in a five minute chart is it clear who people miss that opportunity who people miss that opportunity where to retrace now you can see prices retracing right we are not looking for buy because 20 is still running below 150 here in hdfc yesterday i think so let's see next opportunity we have seen for the sell here we have seen some sell uh we are looking this candle broke this candle right broke in this uh, we are placing sell order in this area below little more here this candle triggered our sell order you can see price is falling down is it clear so you can use anywhere anywhere in this market forex even i use sometime in forex market you know you can you can see so yeah i just triggering and dropping here you can see this one what is this and this is i think double or like double how it should look like that how we can use it in double right have you seen this one already we have seen uh, here you can see this is a buy opportunity was there right buy opportunity was there buy opportunity was there here 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 you can see double yesterday i think buy opportunity was there last bearish candle this one and they broke by this candle and place here by buy order here and finally price is going continuously in a five minute who people are trading in a uh, day trader it is most accurate and profitable trading strategy but learn how to use control yourself don't be hurry and don't jump don't try to catch the running bus most of the people are entering here in this area buy here directly and play somewhere sl and hit their sl that is the big mistake people are often again and again again and again they are doing that thing they don't have persons and entering anywhere in the market don't do that wait for proper opportunity and in this market every day and every time you will get the opportunity and opportunity always comes in this market for your entry remember don't be hurry if the that car or if you miss that bus leave it wait for next bus i think so you people never run behind the car or bus if you miss that bus you wait for the next bus right so same thing you do here also if you leave if you miss that opportunity leave it wait for next bus all right definitely bus will come we know we know in a bus stop we always know that if we miss this bus next bus will come so we are persons and we are waiting for next bus and very smoothly and safely we enter in this bus right same thing in here also opportunity always comes but don't be hurry and don't try to jump and get bus. don't try all right now you can see here we have seen crossover here now price is running we are looking for a very breakout candle so here was last candle was here we have seen breakout and we are looking for sell in this area a little more below what is called this one double i don't know exactly yeah double so there is our sell opportunity okay after crossover if we not found any bullish candle then our ntnl uh, here we have seen crossover are there we are not getting any bar we not getting any sell opportunity leave this don't run in this bus suppose here here this area is not forming okay okay let me remove this one this area is not forming all right all right in that case so most of the people are doing here big mistake all right so suppose this area is not forming all right here leave it leave it this area right here there is no candle there. all right now when 
price is falling down people are start selling here selling here don't do wait this is running bus you miss that opportunity wait wait to retrace wait to form bullish candle all right wait if they are not forming prices continue go for another skip is it clear don't run and don't try to catch the bus most of the people are doing that mistake again and again and again learn from your mistake once sl hit learn from don't do same mistake again and again again and again control your uh, psychology right if you are not able to control your psychology very difficult to win in this market if you control your psychology i'm guarantee you you will earn enough definitely your win ratio will be huge huge win ratio will be control wait patience most important you know patience uh, like uh, psychology factor is most important uh, most important than trading strategy remember is it clear so i think this strategy you can use because i personally i use this for forex all right i use mostly so i think already uh now we completed one hour so i hope uh, from this webinar you comes to know a little more and i think you learn a lot how to trade and how to enter if you have any doubt uh, you will find me in my youtube channel leave that comment all right i clarify you and i'll try to create a video according to your need you just subscribe my youtube channel it is deep and go away you'll find me yeah five minutes and 15 minutes it's very important for day dating. Okay, just a minute. I'll show you my name and actually just a minute. Um, something are there here, something are there. Good. Uh, just a minute. Okay. What is your name? Just a minute. I'll tell you. Yeah, this is my channel name. Here you will be find me in this channel. Dupen Gogoi, D W I P E N G O G O I Gogoi. You will find me here. This is YouTube channel name, Dupen Gogoi. Because in a live chart, I am analyzing there various trades. I'm, this type of trading strategy I'm uh, explaining in my YouTube channel how to pick uh, stock for intraday within five minutes. This type of trading strategy because most of the people are useful from there. And uh, so I'm trying to guide you whatever I can do. If you have any doubt directly, leave a uh, comment because every Saturday I I come in live with a webinar and you can talk with me, but in between that area, it is very difficult and you can, you can leave a comment. So you will come to know and you can visit to my website also. So I am writing there various type of trading strategies and my website profit.com. And this is my website and I'm creating various type of trading strategy and various type of knowledge I'm sharing with. So here you can see what is the trend line, why we need to draw two best trading strategy, how to do position cycle management, how to become a successful trader, how to draw support and resistance, how to trade with candlestick and price action, how to choose stock. Uh, for the long term investment so i'm creating this type of uh, knowledge and uh, and go here basic knowledge so for uh, for new people or experience who don't know what make you successful on what criteria we have to see 
how to trade bond using fundamental, how to uh, stock trading Elliot wave position uh, position calculator pivot point calculator you'll find many things are there and you can go through and read there i think definitely you will learn a little more all right webinar it was very useful to okay 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 so i'm creating some webinar also uh sorry not webinar that is called uh, seminar also i am uh, giving seminars all over India, like uh, recently we was in Mumbai, so there was seminar, and then next I think in Guwahati in Assam, some uh, seminar conducting, they're inviting me, so definitely I'll be there, and next I think somewhere Bangalore, Chennai, maybe. So if somebody from that area, so definitely, Right, so I hope you people are able to understand how to buy Hekanesi and from this webinar, I hope you learn a little more and I give them uh, what I can do. So, so and uh, thanks for your valuable time uh, giving me and to be here. So, so see you uh, in the next webinar on Saturday around 11 a.m. with a new topic or new trading strategy. Okay, so thank you, bye-bye, see you.